Greetings, YouTube! It is I, Merrick! And welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Emerald Solark. It's a little late, I was busy with things and... Well, I didn't have time to do any grinding or whatever, so... Uh, Shukaku is still down at 35, but it's alright. We have plenty of time to get him leveled up in this episode. We're not gonna do all the dialogue for every one of these stupid swimmers. Because I don't feel like it. We're going to try to be more careful with that speed up button though. After we lost our fucking Reiko. After Loxus was taken down by a stupid explosion. And Ekans. By the way, Ekans is apparently the rarer encounter, uh, as opposed to the Groudon we caught in the last episode. Because I thought it was weird as shit. We were, I was only running into Groudon, so I decided to try it. And, uh... All I was running into was Groudons, and then there was a friggin' Ekans. I was like, what the hell? An Ekans? That's kind of cool, but why is that the rare encounter? Oh, that's the top of this city. Yeah, I know. We can't go in there. You have to dive under the watery bullshit. It's got a whooper. Well, it's gonna die. No, it's not, because fucking Super Saiyan missed. Alright, so Super Saiyan must be Gohan, and he slacked off on his training. A Kadabra? Nope, we are switching the fuck out of that shit. There's no way he can hurt Kyrios, and Kyrios is faster anyways. Ha! Intimidate didn't do shit. Shukaku leveled up. Uh, I don't even remember what level fucking Shukaku evolves at. Uh, I, I don't think he evolves to like 50 or so. A level 6 Groudon. That's depressing. We could have caught the level 6 one. I think ours was at least 30 something. Alright, so this is the edge of the... Uh, the observable map. Uh, she's throwing her whole heart into this. Oh, a Sceptile. Poison powder. We had the poison kill. We can just go in and, and slash it, yeah. Oh, didn't see him. Uh, I want to check out your sculpted body, bitch. A uh, Blissey. Good thing Blissey has piss poor physical defense. Uh, I hate registering people. It should be a new route. It should be a new route somewhere around here. Alright, so down there is 128. And there's 129 and 130, 131. Oh shit, we can make this whole episode about encounters. Let's do that. And then, that way, when I have time tomorrow, uh, I will do the whole grinding thing. 
Hell, I don't know why I did Shit. Can't escape. What? Yes, we can. Alright, 127, but we already... We already got our encounter. Why in this shit did we stay in with the fucking Venusaur? Alright, now we're gonna switch. We're gonna switch out. We're not risking an earthquake. See, plus doing this, uh, we'll get Shukaku leveled up a little quicker. And we can... And then by the next episode, I'll have him leveled up with the rest of the team. A polka doll. Wow, that, that was so worth my time. Oh, there's probably a hidden item over here. I don't care. I should care. And I should try to find him, but, you know. Holy crap! Alright, so this is the city. Alright, so route one. Alright. So we go this way. More fucking Dale Caddies. Wow, really? Can we just wake up at least? There we go. Yep, so perhaps we should have switched out. Fuck you, bitch. Head protect. Oh, uh, zero. Uh, yeah, we're gonna switch. Oh, it was just Azura, the baby bitch. I thought it was Azumarill. Shows how much I paid attention. Ah, frig! Wow, his Pokemon sucked ass. Uh, is this the edge of the map? Yes, it is. Alright, so we'll go... We'll go down this way. Until... No, we won't. I thought we would, but... Apparently not. Already missed, time to switch out, we're not playing this game, we are not risking a solar beam. No, we don't want to learn scary face. By the time we get finished, we'll be able to battle against, uh, shit. We'll be able to battle the gym, and we'll be pretty confident about it. Uh, I don't think Shukaku will be a... I saw the route thing change! 
HOLY SHIT! Our encounter is a fucking Charizard. We finally got a fire type, and it's a good one. Alright, this should not kill. I mean, it's choice banding, but it's not stabbing, it's resisting. And, and it's burned. Alright, it's burned. We're not, we're not even mad about that. Alright, we're a little mad about that. Alright, we're gonna go into Super Saiyan. We're not going to do any of those things. We're going to Razor Leaf, because I know it's resisted. Four times. I I don't want to do it again. Because I don't want to risk the crit. The Razor Leaf has a high crit ratio, and none of those were crits. So, we're kind of on edge. Uh, let's use... No, not a Master Ball. Uh, we'll use an Ultra Ball. I want to save that Luxury Ball for a Pokemon that I really, really want. One, two, three, click! Hell yes. Hell to the fucking highest of yeses. The Flame Pokemon. A Charizard flies about in search of strong opponents. It breathes intense flames that can melt any material. However, it will never torch a weaker foe. Well, that's, that's honorable. We're gonna give a name. Oh yeah, we, we got the perfect name. It's a male. We're going to name it Natsu. And now Natsu's gonna go into PC. We're not gonna use him right away. We could have got a coughing. That would have been cool too. Yep. See, we're at 128. Alright, Giovanni, you had your chance. So, we, a fucking Charizard. That is an awesome encounter. I think it's a good way to start off this episode, but, uh... It's not really starting off the episode. Since we're like 12 minutes in. Holy shit. What the hell have we been doing for 12 fucking minutes? Why? Why another one? You know what? No. We are not letting this thing live. Wait. Hold on. Does Thrash hit both of them? I don't know. Try attack. And we got the burn. And it's not exactly helpful, but I'll take it. There goes the Cascade. A Gust. That's what the Suicune attacks us with, is Gust. Why do so many people have Suicune? Why are they taunting me with it? There's an Eddie Charizard. Might actually still get decent experience. Yeah, maybe not. Oh, we, we can get an encounter at Evergrande. Let's save that one for, uh, for later, then. Let's save it for when we actually get to Evergrande City. Alright, nope. You had your chance. Time for Kyrios to save the day. Oh, perfect switch, too, to the steel type. A barboach? That is absolutely nothing to me. Oh, yeah, choice bandit. Whoops. How did we miss Metal Claw? Does Metal Claw have, like, 95 accuracy? I mean, if so, that's completely stupid. Route 129. Is this another new, another new route already? Hold on, wait. Yep, that's 128. So this is 129 right here. This little section here. That's 28. Friggin' Milo Tick. I hate that thing with its stupid defenses. Friggin' Cynthia's Milo Tick was such a bitch. Alright, so. 
We're at 129. Here we go. Our encounter is... <sighs> it's shit. That's exactly what it is. It's utter shit. We're not even using an Ultra Ball. We're fucking great balling this thing. It's not even great. One, two, three, click. The Mushroom Pokemon. A Paris has parasitic Tochukaso. Mushrooms growing on its back. They grow by drawing nutrients from the host. They are valued as a medicine for a long time. Or for a long life. Tochukaso. That's what I always name my Parises, but I forget how to spell it. Okay, wait, wait. To Chu Kase. It's just a weird name. Like, is the Paris the Pokemon or is the the Parasite the Pokemon? Oh shit. And Auron was the well, that was a bad idea. Ha! Beach. I think that's all there is to Route 128. Yep. A freaking ladybug. I hate this thing. So what happens if we go up here? Oh, hey, of course, that's cool. We're gonna go ahead and put Baldy out front. Oh, it used Toxic! For rigging bullshit! Another Tochikasu. Whoa! This beach has a fucking Jirachi! Alright, so that's a little scary. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Alright, uh, here you go, Leviathan. Have some Moo Moo Moo. And then how dare you, you bitch. Whoops, I forgot he doesn't resist or he resists in this game. Son of a bitch! Well, see, Kyrios is the answer to everything. That's why we rely on Kyrios. Go ahead and rest. You're gonna die in your sleep, you know, bitch. Now that's what I like to see. Alright, so... Route 130. Alright, we need to put Venusaur back in the front. Or wait, do we? Now let's leave Baldi out. Because we don't even know what it's going to be. Alright, our Route 130 encounter is... A Corsola. So, we will take it. 
Don't recover, Span. Just stay asleep for one more turn. There you go. There you go. And you're... Like, we'll give you this great ball. It's pretty and blue and... You're a water Pokemon. It makes sense. There we go. The Coral Pokemon. Corsola live in warm southern seas. If the sea becomes polluted, the beautiful coral stalks become discolored and crumble away in tatters. Well, that's a shame. Uh, what do we name a Corsola? I don't know. I, I, I don't have a clue. We're, that's just what we're going with. I don't see us using it. There's too many other good water Pokemon that we already have. He has a clay doll. I don't like that, so we're going out to Kyrios. We didn't have Curios, I don't know what we would do. Scizor is one of the greatest Pokemon ever. Having a Steel type on your team is just, it's so good. It's so freaking good. A Bell Sprout. Are we in a new route? Is that why we saw a Bell Sprout? Yeah, we still have a little ways to go. So we could add a Bell Sprout. We might already have one. Yet. There's all these Varian Corsolas. A Blastoise. No, we're gonna we're going into Super Saiyan. We're just gonna. We know what's gonna happen there. There we go, Baldy leveled up. A Fampy, nope. I know it's a ground type, but we're not taking any chances it has a rock type attack. Alright, so. Put Venusaur out front. Gary Nelson. Oh, Route 131, here we go. New encounter time. And it is. It's a star you. I'm not even mad. I will take a star you. And I think, if I'm not mistaken, I think we have a water stone too. That means that means that we could evolve it and have a star me, which I like star you, because you know when he comes out, he's all like hiya. But when you evolve him, he's not as cool with his because Starmie's just like. Whatever it does. Whoa, that was already too much. Uh, but Stormy, it's purple, and he looks cooler, and Stormy is a beast. So we've got we got power in our PC. We have ridiculous power in the PC. If anybody should choose to die, which we don't want that to happen, the star-shaped Pokemon. It gathers with others in the night. It makes its red core glow on and off with the twinkling stars. It can regenerate limbs if they are severed from its body. That's pretty dope. I must admit, that's pretty sick. We already have a new name for, for him, or well, it's more for Star Me. But, uh, that's what you're gonna be <laughs> when we evolve thee. And we like to name him Shuriken. Alright, so that's a good encounter. I like that. A Cleffa? Die. I hate baby Pokemon. 
Alright, uh, do we get to this town before... Yes, we get to this town before the next route. There's three routes. And then there's this little... I don't even know if we can go to that island yet. I don't know if we can go to that... That fucking... That little tower. See, Shukaku's at 39 now. Getting leveled up. Almost even with the team. And then soon we'll have a fucking... Uh... A, we'll have a request. Not a request, what the hell. We'll have a... Tyranitar. Don't protect spam. I don't care about spikes. Now you're being a bitch. Okay, no, 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 and no. Super Saiyan, you can tank that shit and kill that bitch. Alright, so, no. Alright, so there's Slugma over here. Whoa, we almost had to battle that trainer. Son of a bitch! Look, there's the city right there. Ooh, we could've got a Whisper. That's gross. Yes. We made it to the Pokemon Center. Didn't lose a soul. See, I... <laughs> I wanted this to- oh, Route 131. Nope, we already got our encounter. Never mind. I wanted to just grind this, you know, and this be where I do my grinding session. But at the same time, I was kind of like, uh, well, you know, there's all these encounters in here, and I didn't want you guys to miss out on that shit. I didn't want to just be like, oh yeah, my encounter was a Charizard. No, this time you actually saw it was a fucking Charizard. wasn't like with the Reiko, where you just kind of, you saw it, but you had to, you know. No, this was different, because you saw it in the episode. I think that's all we have is this bitch. Oh, she's got an Eevee. How cute. There's no Pokemon here, is there? Alright, so we're gonna fly... ...all the way back to Mozdi. So we can get more Pokeballs. I just want to make sure we have enough, so we're gonna get 10 more. And then, let's go get those last three encounters on 32, 33, and 34. Alright, so let's go get these encounters. Uh, we should be able to get one right here. Wait, that's route... Alright, so we're on route 132. And our encounter is a Ninkata. No, wait, that's dupes. We have a Ninjask. Alright, so, we're gonna get our Pacific Log encounter first. And it's a Mighty Anna. Did we ever catch a Poochie Anna? I don't think we did. Alright, so, we're gonna send out Super Saiyan. We're just gonna put you to sleep. And we'll just throw a Pokeball at you, because you're level 15. And we physically cannot hurt you. One, two, three, collect. Awesome. The Bite Pokemon. In the wild, my Yen live in a pack. They never defy their leader's orders. They defeat foes with perfectly coordinated teamwork. So, is Mighty Yen a wolf? You 
know what? Forget it. We're, we're on the clock. We're on the clock here. And I want to get these other encounters on here. So we're just going to name him Biter. I forgot about this city encounter. What the hell was I thinking? All right, Route 132. Nincata, that's... That's dupes. What species? But it's the same thing. An elekid! I'll take that. I will take that. Now, it's so many levels below that this should... Okay. Alright, that's fine. That is fine. We can heal the paralysis, no problem. Put him to sleep. Now, I like elekid, so we're gonna give elekid an ultra ball. Plus the yellow and the... And the black goes with the, the yellow and the black. So... Uh, what the hell, bitch? You're asleep. I was even being nice giving you the Ultra Ball instead of a Great Ball. One, two, three. Why? Why are you doing this? There's no need. One, two. Stay asleep. One, two, three, click! There we go. Alright, the electric Pokemon. If it touches metal and discharges the electricity it has stored in its body, an elegant begins swinging its arms in circles to recharge itself. Ah, uh, what should we name an elegant? We're gonna name him Sparky. No, we're just gonna name him Spark. I like Spark. I was trying to think of something creative to go with. God damn it! To go with the fact that he's a fucking plug out that thing. I couldn't think of anything. A excuse me! He's using a fucking what? A fucking level 35 hell oh. Can this bitch calm the fuck down? We've been attacked by wild crowd on in this episode. That one kid had a fucking sweet coon. This asshole has a ho oh. It's fucking gonna recover. God friggin' rod. No! Whirlwind. Uh. Oh no, no, I can't stay in. We can't risk it. Can you fucking stop that? Alright, we should be able to kill it from that range. Probably could have fr from before, but I was really scared to do it. And I really do not want to lose our curious. Oh, uh, we had to kill a Baldi. I'm sorry about that. Alright, so we don't care so much about all this stuff. I will come back and do all this later. A deep sea tooth. Uh, right now, I'm just trying to get to the routes. Alright, 133. And our route thir 133 encounter is... A fucking shell gone. Don't attack it, you foolish fool! Level fucking six. That's not gonna do anything, but we'll take it anyways. One, two, three, click! Alright, so we got a shell gone. The endurance Pokemon. It hardly eats while it awaits evolution. It becomes hardier by enduring hunger. That's kind of extreme. Its shell peels off the instant it begins to evolve. That sounds gross. Ah, uh, what's against Salamence type name?
Salamence. <laughs> Get it? Cause Salamence is a menace. No? Is that no good? All right, I'm sorry. I thought I thought it was I thought it was funny. All right, we need to get here. Our Route 134 encounter is... No, wait, we caught a Butterfree. We caught a Butterfree. Never mind, that's dudes. Yes. Our species, same fucking thing. Our encounter is... Steel Trash. We didn't catch a Butterfree, didn't we? That's- oh shit, maybe we caught a beautifly. I thought we had a Butterfree yet. Maybe I caught a Butterfree in... In my son version? I- I don't know. You don't even see them in this fucking Pokedex. Well. Alright, so it's a Metapod. That's that's just what we're gonna go with. And Kirios Critic. So we didn't need it anyways. Alright. Well, we're gonna wrap this episode up here. Uh, if you enjoyed watching our encounters, we got some great encounters in this fucking episode. Um, hit that like button down below for us. Subscribe if you haven't already. You can follow us on all the social shit we post every time we upload new content. The link's in the description below. In the next episode, we're gonna go take on that Mazdeep gym. Uh, so that'll be pretty exciting. We'll get into the story stuff. Uh, so, we'll see you guys. We're gonna get out of here. We'll see you guys in the next episode.